Josh Beckett, pitcher, Boston Red Sox. Uh, my dad was a baseball player. He played at a small college out in Alpine, Texas called Sol Ross, and uh, so he was always a big baseball fan. I played basketball and football as well. Um, you know, I loved them both. I think it just got get to a point to where I had to make a decision on, uh, you know, uh, you know, had a chance to actually have a career in this, and I think those other things would have been pretty difficult for me. Country music, all country, new country, old country. I like old George Strait. Um, a lot of new stuff so really good. It's kind of getting into like the, the mixture of uh, you know rock and country. Oh, I mean, we get yeah a lot of things. I would I would say the first thing that comes to mind though is playing great golf courses you know, on the road or even during spring training and stuff like that, you know, we get, you know, hosted at some of the nicest golf courses in the United States. And, you know, I'm, I'm really appreciative of it, but, uh, you know, I don't think if it was, wasn't for baseball that they'd be having a, a 12 handicap guy like me out there playing golf. Uh, on the cover of Men's Health, without question. <laughs> yeah, that was definitely it. I would say that my biggest superstition is to not become superstitious because I feel like once you get into those things, it's just, it's very, very difficult to, to mimic them every time and be the, be the same every time. So I try to, I try to mix some por portion of my pregame stuff up a little bit every time just so I can say, okay, I'm not superstitious. I would say that both my World Series go, go there, you know, it's, you know, I won 20 games. That was that was an individual deal, but there's nothing like ending the season on top. You know, I remember in 03 and then again in 07. It's just that there's, and you don't even really realize it right whenever it's over. It takes a couple weeks and then it's like, wow, we just did something really cool. Oh, there's challenges all the time, you know, whether it's just, uh, you know, to pick yourself back up. That's the craziest thing about being a starting, being a starting pitcher is, you know, we gotta wait five days in between starts. So if you have a bad one, you know, it's, you know, and nobody else is there to pick you up. You know, we're all grown men, this is a grown man's world. And, you know, just picking yourself up and, you know, moving on to your next start and having the same confidence that you had two starts ago. I'd say uh, the start of uh, the Josh Beckett Foundation. I think we've raised a little over a million dollars for the Children's Hospital in Boston. Um, you know, it's something that's really dear to me because a friend of mine's son that went through, uh, brain cancer was born with it and their outlook on it was really uh it's really awesome yeah I, I use it all the time you know I, I feel like it really i used to have really bad neck problems you know throughout the season and since i started wearing fighting you know i, I say this every year in this interview it's that you know it, it really does actually help my neck and that's the biggest thing for me you know is, is being able to go out there and feel healthy and, and being able to perform if anybody's ever had a crick in your neck it makes your whole day miserable You know, I, I just said it, you know, it's, it's very helpful, you know, for me. I think that that would have to be the word because I really haven't had a neck problem since, since I started wearing it, and it's, it's really helped me that way.